have a very simple message for you today. There's many good things going on with hand washing. There's a lot of commitment in our facility uh, to keep the HAIs down or, or eliminated through better hand washing. The reality is with everything that we're doing, even though we're passing the management acceptance levels, we're passing the auditing tests, we still see from our research that our frequency of hand washing is well below. In fact, it's a little less than half of what you really want it to be. You're, you're happy that reports around 90% compliance, but there are a few people that believe this. The compliance is much lower than that. Now, how are we going to solve this? With what we're doing today, as good as we all are doing, our risk is up here in an area that we do not want it to be. We feel that can be lowered down to an acceptable level with this difference, and that is adding electronic hand wash monitoring to your existing quality uh, observational systems. Do this, that will set a standard, that will verify the standards, that will give you a base to, uh, to reward success that will change behaviors in a consistent pattern and bring that risk down. One more thing I'd like to share with you. That is this behavior change question. Normally, when we look at behavior change, what do we do? Let's do more in-service training. Let's do more of what? Of the things that we've been doing and we're going to get the same result, right? So what's wrong with this picture? Well, what we've been doing is changing the behavior focused on the nurse assistants and the caregivers. That's an important focus, but there's even a more important one, and that is to get management to understand what the issues are, get them behind the investments that are required to solve this problem. We need to change behaviors by the ownership, by the, the management, the C-suite people, the patient safety people, the operations. This is the group where we need to get behind. We have some ideas on the website on that. We'd invite you to take a look at that. Uh, but I think you'll agree that we need to do something to bring that risk down and increase patient safety. Thank you.